So I'm here at the Water Cube uh, with, oh, that's a long name, Mr. Palani Sami. Exactly. Please introduce yourself. Okay. Thank you. I am Palani Sami, uh, representing International Water Management Institute at South Asia Office, Hyderabad, India. Actually, I'm heading a program called uh, IMI Tata Water Policy Program. The main emphasis of the program is how the research can be translated into policy makers. Okay. One of the success stories is in India, the micro irrigation, particularly drip and sprinkler, the spread is much, much limited. We did a detailed study, then we found out uh, mostly, most of the farmers, they don't know how to operate the drip and sprinklers. So we developed a small program called and capacity building program to the farmers. After the introduction of the capacity building program to the farmers, uh, then farmers started uh, managing the system very well. Mm -hmm. The yield and water saving have dramatically increased. Now there is a demand for such a capacity building program to the farmers and uh, regional wise. So we are now exploring options how best the capacity building program for the technologies and water can be introduced and upscaled. Mm -hmm. And in which region is this in India? It is in the southern region called Tamil Nadu state, southern India, where a lot of uh, drip irrigation programs are going on. But the, when the drip irrigation is going on, program through government investment, the adoption rate is much declining. So the reason is farmers, they don't know how to operate and maintain mm -hmm. it because of the clogging and other problems. So we are addressing these problems. So after uh, getting the proper experience and expertise from the training program, farmers are now very much uh, satisfied. Now the program is going on with the water saving and yield increase. So this is also our message is whenever we introduce uh, any technology on water management, it is also coupled with the capacity building programs. Then only farmers will realize the importance of these technologies so that they can upscale it very much to benefit the larger community. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for Thank his you. message and uh, good luck with uh, expanding as I hear it's good results so yeah, far. Yeah, actually now only all the farmers are coming forward, they want more drip irrigation programs. Earlier they were installing it but after some problem they stuck and they closed to this one. Now after the capacity building programs, now they are confident this drip can be easily installed and maintained at the farm level. Okay. Yeah, that's one. Yeah. Good news. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay, thank you. And hope you enjoy the week here. Yeah, in Sweden. exactly. Yeah. Enjoy nice climate and enjoy seeing people also. Okay, <laughs> okay. Thank, thank you, thank, thank you, you, thank you.